we had yet another video here um, surrounding the whole fight between uh, Jake Paul and Nate Robinson. So uh, this time we got Rick Ross reacting to everything that's happened now afterwards with the whole challenge that's going on, clowning on Nate Robinson. But I'm going to let you guys check it out. Lil Will, why y'all did Nate like that last night? Man. Man, that shit ain't right. You know what I'm doing over here? I'm finna find me a Nate Robinson jersey to put on today. Y'all got the Nate Robinson challenge going on. They picking on the man. That's my dog, man. Man, what all teams Nate Robinson played on? I gotta find me a jersey, man. Crazy, man. I don't know what's going on, man. Crazy, man. I don't know, man. We got to find it, a... man. I'm finna find me a Nate Robinson jersey. It ain't right. Y'all did my dog wrong. Y'all know he was promoting Wingstop. Y'all know that man, man. Man, I think it ain't no secret I don't have a Nate Robinson jersey. But this is what I want you to do, Nate. I want you to still go get you a 50-piece wing stop and find a way to enjoy the day. All the memes going on, everybody face down, ass up. I get it. I get it. I get it. But, Nate, you went in there, you got you a check. Let's look at the positive side. Go play a one-on-one -on -one with you, man. Go play a five-on-five. Um, five. Go live on a five-on-five. Five. So yeah, you guys could see in the video right there, Rick Ross, he was on Instagram speaking on the whole situation. Now afterwards, uh, with this whole new uh, quote-unquote Nate Robinson challenge, uh, where everybody's laying face down, basically clowning him for getting knocked out. But you guys can leave a comment down below what you think. I'm going to see you all in the next video.